Hey, tall fool, listen to the humble cries of a grain of dust. Let the minds of the lings and the walls dwell on the path of seven fold, that there may be peace between them. And forever my devotion I pledge. Ah, may, tall fool. understand. The hatred between our families is just too deep. Listen, nothing is going to stop me from marrying you, no matter how much hatred there is between our family. Please, darling, it'll only mean more death to our people.
在你眼冇人能可能离开我哋吧？哎，好，听住佢，走翻入去，走啦，哎，哎，唔唔唔，走呀！阿伯父啊，阿、啊、明 ，I have a moment with you. My answer to you was final. 等我再次同你讲多几句啦。No, son of my enemy, you go. 仔呢唔配我个女，佢唔应该嚟见佢。咩啊？我仔唔见得你个女，一定系唔见得，冇问题呢。佢要嚟见我个女嘅，问题啊！我哋嘅姓王咯，几百年喺呢个世界树唔见啦，你个女，因为我哋唔。You see, Tom, our families will never come to an understanding. I think they will, my dear. Your prayer to the enlightened one will be answered. Oh, if it could only happen, we'd be so happy. 可以同你做亲家，所以有咁多钱，有咁多世界。That's what I get for teaching you to tell time, you old slave driver. You know you're worse than a city editor. Hey, Samboni. Hello, Harry. What's in your mind? How'd you like to lay your hands on a jade necklace worth 50 grand? Oh, why don't you quit smoking the stuff? Yeah? <laughs> Read that. So you know that uh, Chinese merchant Ling, don't you? Mm, yeah. Have you still got the recording machine? Yes, I still got it. Say, that's the spot for it. Right. And I can fence that necklace if you can get it. This is not the place to talk. Let's go over to my room. Help! Help! Morning, buddy. Hello there. What's the matter? Did the Herald beat you to a story again? Yes, again. Maybe that's why I can't sell a chronicle. All they seem to be good for is wrapping paper. You go out and try to sell them, will you?
Let's see what he does. All right. I guess that'll straighten it out. Gee, fine. Casting, come with me. All right, Napoleon. It looks like our slave driver is on the warpath this morning. Woo. Hey, Martin. Coming. Hurry up. It's Robert, sir. Butler speaking. You get that story before you come back, or go home and tell your wife you've lost your job. Will you have an aspirin, Mr. Butler? No. Mr. Martin, in your busy life, have you by any chance read our rival morning newspaper? Oh, yeah. And you know, I particularly enjoy that Chinese new yarn. Why didn't you get that story? Because you had me down in the aquarium showing a little girl how to write about a big fish. Did that take you 24 hours? No. But you see, then your instructions were that I should take your sweet little protege and show her how to get nightclub news. And then, I suppose, when you got home, you tripped over a milk box. <laughs> How'd you get it? I'm through listening to your alibi. Now, wait a minute, wait a minute. I've got a new idea on that Chinese romance. Pardon, get that story. Out of the typewriter. Get off my desk. Get that dog down. What do you mean you're bringing him in here? Go ahead and lie down, Sergeant. Go ahead. Now listen to this. Today, for the first time in 200 years, a Wong will sip tea and break bread with a lady. And Tom Wong, the prospective bridegroom, will present the bride with a rare jade necklace. Said necklace, that's considering the age and the intrinsic... The, the, a lot of big words in that story. Yeah. The, the intrinsic... Well, the thing is worth $50,000. Now, isn't that nice? And if I were to run it with a picture, I'd have a lovely little society note. You big sissy. He objects to that big. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Well, we cover Chinatown. But not yet. First, you're going to take Miss Pollock to the polo grounds and show her how to interview the celebrities. Now, wait a minute. Me playing teacher that James going far enough. Where are those passes? Have you seen them? Where are they? I gave them to you. Don't you remember anything? You're getting more stupid all the time. I've always known you were stupid, but my, you're getting worse and worse. Can't find anywhere. <coughs> Pardon me, Mr. Butler. They're in your pocket. Oh, oh, come here. There are your passes. Now you can get to that Chinese pink tea later. Thanks, Santa Claus. Come on, boys. Take that to my dumb pupil, will you?
There are telephones for messages, Mr. Martin. My, how observant. You know, observation is the first requisite of a good reporter. Thank you, teacher. Come on, Sergeant. I didn't even see that firefly. Maybe it wasn't there. Come on, Bobby. Sergeant, stop that. Thank you, Tarzan. Did you do as I told you? Yes. Then you got the interview. How could I miss with such a marvelous tutor? That's right. Well, that lets me out. Now you stay and get the final score because I'm going down to Chinatown. I'm going too. You have to stay and get the final score. I'm going to Chinatown. Well, if you do, you'll get fired. I don't care. I'll go to work for another paper. That's great. Look, will you go home and tell your mother I hate you? I never lie to my mother. Come on, Tarzan. You see, Mr. Ling, if you permit me to occupy the quarters upstairs, I can be on hand for the entire preparations. Mr. Samboni, you mean we can record the details leading up to and including the wedding? Every detail. Then we can send this records to our honorable relations in China, eh? Most certainly. That's good. Then when can you be ready? Oh, I can be ready for the first entertainment. That is afternoon, isn't it? How do you know? <laughs> the Chronicle, late edition. Oh, may I read it? Certainly. May I use your phone? Yes. Yeah. Thank you. I'll have my equipment brought right over. That's excellent. Hello? Granite 1254. Granite. Hello? Yeah. Okay, right away. Sam Boney, put it over. We are packing the recorder. Boy. Long and his jewels will soon be part of that. Tom, you going to have a family of your own? Yes, father. 
呢串珠呢，係我哋王先生嘅書呢，幾十年啦，係你嫁你嘅女呢，你送俾佢。Father, you are very generous, isn't it wonderful? Say, you two wait outside. When I leave this work, I'll pass it to you. No. We're staying right here. Say, I'm wrong in this. Too many of us around here might spoil it. Maybe he's right, Ray. Of course I'm right. Maybe so. But we'll be waiting. All right. Have the car ready so we can make it fast get away. Don't you stall, Saponi. Come on, Harry. What can you find how pretty left? Hey, watch where you're going. Sorry. My name is Ann Parker, and don't call me sister. Well, maybe I'm wrong, but uh, sob sister refers to a uh, newspaper woman. Come on, boy. Come on. Who are they? I don't know. How are you, Mr. Martin? Fine, Miss Ling, and uh, congratulations. This is Miss Ann Parker. She's also one of our uh, reporters. How do you do, Miss Parker? How do you do? Oh, hello, Tarzan. Nice dog. Nice dog. Oh, go, Dai La. This means a nice doggy in Chinese. <laughs> I would like an uh, exclusive story on your engagement party. Do you think the public would really be interested in such an unimportant matter? <laughs> Why, of course. Uh, pardon, I did not mean to interrupt, but the recording machine is ready, Miss Lee. When you have time, will you come up and we'll try it out? Yes, I'll come right away. Thank you. Recording machine? Yes. Oh, Mr. Zamboni, these are my friends of the press, Mr. Martin and Miss Parker. Delighted. Uh, Mr. Oh, uh, Mr. Zamboni is going to record our wedding and the peace talks of our fathers. And then we're going to send the records to China. Say, that's a story. My, how you catch your eye. Well, why don't you interview him? If it's all right. Quite all right. Yes, come with me. Are you coming? No, I'll stay down here and talk to Joy Ling's father. All right. How are you, Mr. Martin? Lee, I'm glad to see you again. Presence mine. Thank you. <laughs> Very good. Charming. Now you'll see we can hear it at once on a record. Oh. It's so simple, anyone could work it. <laughs> and uh, how many deaths occur each year caused by the Wang Ling feud? It is hard to say. There's so many of us. Oh. Well, we. They hope. Oh, I'm going to bow like a Hello, Wang. How are you? You see, I have uh, two microphones. 
Well, what's this one for? <laughs> this is for big banquets and special celebrations. I see. <laughs> Shall we go down now? Oh. Yes. <laughs> Let's go. Waiting gag. Looks like the double cross. Yeah. Maybe. We'll soon find out. Yeah. Well, I think we're going to have a keen celebration. I'm sure you are. Hey, what about that polo story? What about it? Well, didn't you phone it in? Oh, I forgot. What a fine reporter. Give it to me. Oh, Mr. Ling, may my associate use the phone? Certainly. It's all right, Mr. Martin. Thank you very much. Sorry, Mr. Ling. Thank you. I want you. I will have a chair to have you join with us. Oh, thank you. The third alarm on that fire and no reporters. Martin was supposed to phone in every hour. I haven't heard from him in three. I'll break his neck. Butler speaking. Oh, it's you. Why, you... Uh, uh. All right, then give me a rewrite, man. Big baboon. And you hurry up, or the fire will be out. Okay. Come on, Bright Eyes, we're going to cover a fire. I'm staying. I like it here. Okay, I'll see you at the office. Well, come on, good luck, folks. Oh, I'm sorry, you can't come stay. Come on, boy. Come on. Oh, how pretty! I, I hope this necklace will join our families too. Gentlemen, this is a marvelous opportunity for a speech. You may commence. Thank you, Panga. Come on, go open it. Now you please. I'm going to say it all for me in English. Splendid <laughs> idea. Gentlemen, you remain here and keep on talking all the time through the microphone. I shall go upstairs and see if the apparatus is working perfectly. You're very thoughtful. Thank you. Repeat what I said in Chinese, eh? If you will. Uh, say, boy. Um, help me with my apparatus, will you? Yeah. Come in. Very happy message to our Ling and Wong family. That's what they say. Thank you. Oh, oh. oh yes, tell me what you said too, please. I said uh, that uh, I am also very pleased to be on this marvelous occasion.
What I said just now, that my son Relatives and friends, I said that they on 10th of May to have our son have their ceremony. All you are invited. That sounded like a scream. Yeah, that's what I thought. Lingma, Lingma. the law. I got you. The motor's missing. Must be the carburetor. Have it adjusted? Yeah, the other day. Mr. Ling man. He did it. Look, she's up. Let me out of here! Kill the motor. We've waited long enough. We're going in there. Watch him. Sure. Oh, hello, boys. Give me the necklace. No, I didn't get it. Well, what was all the excitement about downstairs? Oh, a Chinese uh, stole the necklace. We don't believe you. I swear. Oh, I, I think you're a double cross. You had that necklace spotted? Come through. Come through. How about flag yet? A police. You are mistaken, my friend. Never mind that friend stuff. You know what the double cross means? Give me that necklace. I swear. I, I think, think you're a double crosser. Yeah, boy. You take that to where? I'll take it over. Go ahead. Big day. You tell you what? More day. Bigger than Castle. Get him. Go. 
慢慢，那我就不说，这用办法不好。没错，对，发生这个，这还叫你急吗？没人，没人，不是在，没人有人，没报销，没人，没人，没人。经过打死个老王，你，你嘛，系你嘛，你。Hi, Lee. Hi, Lee. You? No. My fool must have done it. He's gone away. What do you find? You go. You just find it. You two go. Find it. Just go. We find it. All right. Figure a way to get the necklace. That's all. You're gonna figure a way to get the necklace. No funny business. So I'll fill you for all that. Well, I can give you what I haven't got. What's that? We better get out of here. Sit down. I think you're lying. We're not going to leave here until you talk. Thank you. See about that noise, Harry. Stay where you are.
Lord. Bob, come quickly. Big scoop. What's that? Who's in there? Take it to Bob. Pick it up, Tarzan. Hurry, get it. Get it. Pick it up. Hurry, Tarzan. Now take it to Bob. Quick. Who are you? Get in there. Where are those jewels? I've told you I don't know. I wish I did. What's this, a gag? Where have you been? She's got it. Oh, I didn't hide it anybody. Yes, you did. 
What are you doing in there? Oh, I just fell off, that's all. That sounds funny to me. Come on along. Well, Old, here's a present for you. What's the matter, Martin? I don't know, Old, but it looks like we're going to have a lot of company around here. Say, Lynn, give me the keys out front door. Where What's your name, name, miss? Ann Parker. That's all right, Old, she's a reporter on the Chronicle. And Ann, don't you say another word while I find talking. Give me those keys. Hey, now listen here. Tata! The Most High One has answered our prayers. Do our honorable fathers agree? It is written that the Lings and the Wongs shall have peace. 
Who do you think you're talking to? Now listen to me, you red-nosed seahorse, and if you don't like it, I'll sell the story to another newspaper. Yeah, and that goes for Gilmore, too, the old walrus. Gil. Uh, hold the wire. I said hold the wire. What is it, honey? The old walrus you refer to yeah. is my father. Gilmore, who owns the paper, is your... Parker's my pen name. Oh. Hey, Butler. Will you do me a favor? Ask Gilmore if I can marry his daughter, will it? <laughs> Say, listen, you numbskull. This is a newspaper, not a matrimonial bureau. And if you don't give me that story, I'll...